We all know headband wigs are great for people who want a low effort wig, don't want to deal with lace, glue, and all of that. So seeing it with lace, I was like, uh, what was the point? <laughs> like, this is exactly what we are running away from. I had no idea what to expect, how much lace was on the wig or anything like that. But I kind of like this idea. So YG Wigs decided to get ahead of the competition with this headband wig with lace and I was like, why? When they reached out to me for a sponsorship, I went to look at videos, I didn't see anything. So I was just kind of like, okay, I'm gonna find out when I find out. So today we're gonna take a look. The wig comes in a bag and there's a lot going on in here. There's an edges brush, hair clips, a $5 gift card, wig caps. The booklet is very nice. Ostrich lashes hoop earrings, and a scarf, charcoal headband, and a beige one too. So this is the box. There is this compact tangle teaser. I like it. I bet it would be great on vacation. Hair details, 18 inches, kinky curly at 150% density. And here is the wig. There's the lace. I don't like the animal print band, but it's okay. Underneath, you can see that the cap is breathable and there's a U-shaped lace closure. Back to the tangle teaser, it did a good job. I was pleasantly surprised when I followed up with my regular brush and realized that the hair was perfectly detangled. And and I might try it on my natural hair one day, maybe. For curl definition, I'm using my Uncle Funky's Glossy Spray and Trey Lux High Definition Gel. I rushed through the process, but you guys know how I do this and the curls were amazing. Now it's time for me to put on the wig and this is what it looks like dry. It's very nice and poofy. I already tried it on, but I'm gonna go ahead and wear it again. Anchor the back comb. Pull the wig forward to cover the front and then finish with the straps in the back. We all know headband wigs are great for people who want a low effort wig, don't want to deal with lace, glue, and all of that. So seeing it with lace, I was like, uh, what was the point? <laughs> like this is exactly what we are running away from. I had no idea what to expect, how much lace was on the wig or anything like that. But I kind of like this idea because... Now I have a part here and I can fake scalp, whereas before it was just all weft and the weft was kind of bulky. There was some weight to it. If you've had a headband wig in the past, there is some weight to it right here where the band is. Whereas now I've got a little bit of lace here and it's not so bulky in the closure area. I'm gonna put my powder in, is this glitter? Oh, geez, I'm using a glitter brush. Okay, all right. The good thing is that it's just a tiny amount of lace that allows you to put a part in the wig. And I'm using my Fenty powder to get the scalp effect. So a small part is gonna give me this nice realistic look. And it's kind of like the lace wigs with bangs. Also, it's gonna be easy for me to tie my hair down if I want to work out. This is it. This is the most basic look that you can get with this wig. Just a middle part and put the makeup and go. I don't really like the middle part. I don't even know what looks good on me these days, but I'm going to switch to the side just a little bit and see how that works out. So just readjust. This is good. Yeah. So I don't like the band because it's animal print. I don't like animal print and I also have limited styling options with it, but that's not a problem because I can always cover it up with something I have or hide it. So I'm going to tuck in or under. Let me readjust my straps. Okay, much better. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to grab some more powder and get in here, especially right on the edge. I have some gel here. I'm going to put some gel in my part to kind of make it sit down a bit. All right, so this is it. If I want the lace option, I can do this. If I want the headband option, I can leave the headband out so I can go in between the different looks. Though I do feel like there is room for improvement, I guess. You could make it a true hybrid wig if they just made it more like a flap right there in the middle where the lace is. Of course, this works best with a kinky curly hair type. Straight hair will definitely snitch on you and that's all there is for this video. So thank you YG Wigs for sponsoring it and thank you guys for watching as always. I will catch up with you guys soon. Take care of yourselves and bye!